Hi, I'm Corwin Southern, Pediatric Occupational Therapist at ERMAC, and today we're going to look at some different developmental milestones that babies reach from 8 months to 10 months of age. So, we're going to take this little guy right here, and we're going to put him in sitting position. And the different areas we're going to look at is what babies use for movement, so large muscles, and then what they do with their hands, and then we'll look at some different social um, different activities and things that babies should be doing at this age. So first of all, uh, sitting. So this little guy is sitting really good, has good balance, and that's what we'd expect to sit without any support. And then with his hands, he's able to hold the rattle and move it around. He's got a good hand grasp and strength for that. He plays with it. Um, often you'll see a hand transfer. So take it from one hand to the other hand. So both hands. What if I put it right there? And then a lot of times it's very common that you take, take an object, bring it to midline, and take it right up to his mouth. So looking at his hand skills, if I take something small like this and hand it to him, he's able to grab it and brings it right to his mouth. And as a reminder, at this age, a lot of times babies typically will take an object and bring it to their mouth. So make sure you have age-appropriate toys that they don't choke on. And so he's using his hand skills, and this is good for play, as he starts to grab objects, move up from right hand to left hand. And if I take him and I put him on his tummy, he's able to hold his head up with good, good neck strength. He's starting to put weight up on his elbows, and this is all in preparation for a movement. So if I take something, put over here, what I'm looking for is to see if he can get to the object by using his arms, his hands, he reaches it, he grabs it, and he's successful. So that's all good development at this age. Good, he's still moving it, so I'm gonna help him get back up into sitting. And a couple social things that uh, he should be able to do is if I take it, object away, he recognizes that it's not there anymore. So he turns, he's looking his head, turning his head to the right and the left. Where did that object go? And as I bring it back, he grabs it again. At this age, uh, he's able to recognize his name. And how he would do that is if, if I did say his name, that he would again look look to where the sound was coming from for his name, and then he would have a facial expression of his, his eyes might light up a little bit as, as, as if you say his name. I'm gonna take this away, and following simple directions, so if I put this right here, and uh, show him that, he grabs it with both hands, and if I take my finger and I poke it into right there see if he'll do what I'm doing I put your finger in there hmm? just like that right there. Hmm? so he's interested in the object he may or may not do it there he he's recognizes the hole and that's what I want him to do again brings it up to his mouth so we've looked at some large movement patterns. We looked at some hand skills, um, looking at his finger, be able, be able to use those for play, and also some, some, some social skills. He should be able to say mama, dad, dad, and uh, be able to interact with mom and dad. And if you have any questions about the development of your child, uh, contact your pediatrician. Thanks.